So I have ADHD, and one of the biggest things that has helped me and changed the game for me is nutrition, and most importantly, cutting sugar out. So if you want to improve your mental health, whether it be ADHD, anxiety, depression, even your health in general, your personality, just the way you look at, look at the world, honestly, stop eating sugar. Um, don't, I'm not saying you can never eat sugar in your life, but think of it in terms of this. We evolved on this planet in a, in a world of food scarcity. We went long bouts without eating. We had to work very hard to get our food, you know? Um, we, we barely had access to fruits and stuff like that. And so our system, when we eat this sugar, is extremely sensitive to it. And over time, when you eat sugar all the time and you're eating refined carbohydrates, you're basically, over time, desensitizing yourself um, to that extreme, almost orgasmic amount of pleasure that comes from eating sugar. And so by doing this, you're affecting the same, it's the same system for any, everything, your pleasure reward system. It's the same for, you know, sex, drugs, food, all of that. So when you're, when you're eating, you might, you might not do drugs, you might not drink alcohol so much, but you eat a shitty diet, you eat a lot of sugar, that's gonna really impact your mental health and make it harder for you to feel good. That's how you gotta think about it. It's basically you're, you're desensitizing yourself to pleasure, so it takes more for you to feel something, therefore inducing anxiety, depression, ADHD. I mean, that's basically the definition of ADHD is it's very hard to, to feel stimulated. So people like myself, you know, growing up, I definitely seeked very risky and crazy behavior um, that really stimulated me, you know, and I did a lot of stupid stuff in college too that really stimulated me because I, I like required that extra amount of stimulation whereas another person might be a little bit more chilled out and I do highly attribute that to my diet growing up, you know, and it's, it was very sugar based um, and kind of in recent years after doing kind of like a more ketogenic paleo experimenting in that world, I know it sounds extreme, but it's, it's tremendously changed my life, my body, my everything, you know? Uh, it took some time because obviously it's, I mean, you can look it up. Sugar affects the brain just like cocaine. So it's, it's not such an easy addiction to break, but it is an addiction nonetheless. Um, but in breaking that addiction, in, in kind of avoiding that and like taking time to remove that from your life and, and do all that stuff, you resensitize yourself to pleasure, every pleasure in life, not just food. So check it out.